welcome back. If you're a fan of the 80s film 9 to 5, then you're going to want to head to the Lerner Theater this weekend. I'm joined now by Ashley Harrington from Premier Arts. You guys are putting on this show. Uh, I just asked you to kind of refresh me on that because for those who may have never seen the movie, tell us what it's all about. Yeah, so it follows the storyline of three women, both in different stages of their lives with different goals and different turmoil they're experiencing. And they kind of come together to rise above and find their own space and, and recognize their worth and fight for it until they're they're recognized by everyone else for their worth. So tell me who you're playing on stage. So my character name is Dora Lee, but it's based off of the Dolly Parton character from the movie that everybody, well, most everybody knows and loves. So I'm getting to play my girl Dolly for a minute. Yeah. I, how is that like kind of putting that on stage? How's that been? I love 9 to 5. I have always loved the movie growing up. Uh, I was a little young for loving it, I think, based on the <laughs> time that I was born. But I always loved it. And I think the musical is even better because it's the storyline you know and love but expanded upon. So they've added wonderful music. Obviously, 9 to 5's in there. But then they have Dolly Parton's hit, Backwood Barbie, and um, some other songs that Dolly Parton wrote the music and lyrics for. And so it's some country but also some pop rock. And I think there's a song for everybody. So, so fun. Has that been like difficult to, to learn those songs and sing them? Not for me, just because yeah. I listen to music all day, every day. If there's yeah. no music in my life, I'm sad. So <laughs> I've been, I've listened to that music for a long time. But I think the cast, as soon as, because I, I vocal directed it too. So as soon as we kind of dove in and I was like, just wait to hear these songs, they just fell in love. And I think it's underplayed a little bit. I think when people come in, they won't know what to expect and they'll leave with a new favorite song because it really is lovely. Uh, one of the things I always love about you guys at Premier Arts, you, you do so well with the stage presence and, and what you do like with the, you know, just the costumes, everything on stage, the props. So walk me through that. What does that look like for this show? This one's interesting, right? Because it's set in like 1980s. So some of the cast members are a little younger. And so we have things like typewriters and corded phones and people are like what is this and they didn't they'd never seen a typewriter before uh so it's a little funny to joke around about but it's definitely nostalgic and the costumes are just right out of the 1980s and the hair and makeup and i don't know it's like a blast from the past but in the best way oh my goodness so much fun so what do people need to know if they want to get tickets this weekend yeah so they can uh visit the learner theater box office or they can call um or you can head to our website premierarts.org and uh, there'll be a link for ticket information there there you go, and that's the information right there, and those are the dates where everything's happening. So head on out to Learner Theater. Ashley, thank you. It's going to be a lot of fun. Thank you so much. Awesome. Well, stay with us. We'll be right back.